This is question 6 of Civil Engineering General Aptitude section of Gate 2016 Afternoon Session. Two finance companies P and Q declared fixed annual rate of interest on the amount invested with them. The rates of interest offered by this company may differ from year to year. Year-wise annual rates of interest offered by this company are shown by the line graph provided below. If the amounts invested in the companies P and Q in 2006 are in the ratio 8 is to 9, then the amount received after one year as interest from company P and Q would be in the ratio. So in this question, a line graph of rates of interest offered by two company P and Q are given for several years. The ratio of amount invested in the company P and Q in 2006 are given as 8 is to 9. Now we need to find the ratio of amount received after one year as interest from company P and Q. So in this question the uh, amount invested that is principal amount for company P and Q in year 2006 are in the ratio. 8 is to 9. So, we can say the principal amount of P by principal amount of Q in year 2006 is given 8 is to 9. This is for year 2006. And for 2006, the rate of interest, the rate of interest for P is given as 6% and rate of interest for Q is given as 4 percent. Now we need to find the ratio of interest from company P and Q after one year. So time is one year for both. So we know the interest can be find by formula principal into time into rate of interest by 100. So, interest for company P will be the principal amount is 8. So, suppose it is 8x, 8x into time. Time is 1 year, 1 year and rate. So, rate is 6%. So, 6%. So, it, it becomes 8 into 6 that is 48x by 100 and similarly the interest received after one year for company Q will be principal amount. So, principal amount sub, this is 9 so suppose 9x, 9x into time is one year and rate of interest for Q is 4 percent, 4 percent. So, it is 9 into 4 that is 36 x by 100. Now, the ratio, ratio of, ra ratio of interest received for company P by that of Q is 48 x by 48 x by 100 divided by 36 x 36 x by 100 so 100 and 100 cancelled out x and x cancelled out 48 so 12 into 4 48 and 12 into 3 36 so it is 4 is to 3 so the ratio of amount received after one year as interest from company p and q comes 4 is to 3. So, 4 is to 3 is in given in option D. So, option D is the correct answer for this question. Thank you.